Hello, and welcome to this video on Windows Defender and Windows Firewall on the defense. Now, where are they, first of all? Well, if you go into the control panel, they're under their corresponding names. You notice there's one here called Windows Defender and one called Windows Firewall. So, before we begin, what is a firewall? Well, a firewall is software or hardware device designed to prevent unauthorized communications from leaving or entering the computer or network. So there's certain types of computer communications that aren't necessary for everyday use. Um, a lot of them are used for more enterprise type things. A lot of them are just old and not used anymore, but they can be used to can hack your computer. So basically what this does is it blocks a lot of those and you can specify what those are if you want. However, just for this short easy way, it just blocks these things for you and if a hacker tries to use them or a malicious program, it can't. It blocks it. It's that simple. It keeps it from using these things. So Windows has a built-in firewall and again the settings were there in the control panel and you can use it to block certain websites or block certain types of things. However, I'm not going to go over it just because it is a little bit complicated. However, if you do not have a firewall on your computer, it's good just to turn it on and let it do its thing by itself. It does have automatic settings that work pretty well. And Windows Defender is the Windows built-in antivirus and spyware protection. Now this was from Windows 7 on. So only Windows 7, Windows 8, 8.1 have this. You must have a legitimate version of Windows to use it. And it actually does a pretty good job. But you do have to make sure it is also on. So you can go into the control panel, click on Windows Defender, and make sure it's working for you. Now, if you have a paid antivirus, it usually turns off Windows Defender because they conflict. And that's perfectly fine. But just make sure if Windows Defender is off that you do have another antivirus running on your computer. 